Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Tonight, we're going to be working on set 75369, Boba Fett's Mech. Now, we're going to pair this with a nine-year Knob Creek Kentucky Bourbon. It's one of my favorites, to be honest. Uh, as you can tell, as I empty the model out, I usually have a glass or so of it when I'm sitting here building Legos in the office just to take off that edge. Now, pardon my voice tonight. I've come down with a little bit of a cold, so I don't know if I'm going to be too talkative in this one, but I'll give it my best shot. Now, this particular set comes from the Mech Set Series, come out in 2023, and currently there are four of these sets, three of which are soon to retire, which is how I got this one for $7.99 at Walmart because I caught it on clearance. It was just one of those happen to walk down the right aisle at the right time kind of situations. Now, I feel like this here is probably a little nod to the 1979 Boba Fett prototype toy. It was produced by Kenner Toys, and it was never released because the executive deemed it a choking hazard because it launched rockets from its jetpack. At least that's how I feel about it in my mind, anyway. Just a little bit of Star Wars info dump for you. Now, this mech has two action features other than being posable. It's got a built-on stud shooter, and it also has a launchable rocket out of the jetpack. As for the minifigure itself, this is one of the most detailed Boba Fett figures we have gotten to date, featuring front leg printing and detailed arm printing as well as helmet printing. Overall, I'd give this set an 8 out of 10. Y'all have a good night and you take care of yourselves now.